um, being sensitive to the family and its needs, um, the family as a unit, um, the income of the family and how it impacts the whole family unit and the stress of having to try to make ends meet. Uh, communication huge, communicating with the family, communicating with those children if you have children, uh, and even communicating with the social service agencies that can provide the service that you need. Oh my goodness, today's simulation was so on point because I can see how some of our parents have shared with us how they are just, uh, their whole day is spent with trying to access um, resources that are in the community. Sometimes it's transportation barriers, sometimes it's um, accessibility, just, um, and sometimes it's interacting with that person that's behind that desk. Um, but once again, it's all on the communication and then having to talk with caseworkers, uh, work, working with, um, you know, even parents as teachers. I believe that we do a very important service to our families just by helping them navigate through the community and, um, you know, teach teachable tools and teachable moments and situations and the tools we provide for them. Goodness, just life skills. Being able to plan a budget. Um, navigating your way through making those real hard decisions. Are you going to you know, pay the mortgage? Are you going to buy the meds? Are you going to provide the food? Who's going to take care of those kids? All of the above. Being prepared, plan A and plan B if something happens with that person who's employed. So once again, parents as teachers, we're doing a wonderful service to the families just by making sure that we're there to help them navigate through the system and working with them with their own personal family uh, plan.